right guys, so here's where we're at. Our next project for Blackwell Adventures is gonna be building an outdoor shower at our cabin. Um, and for that, we need wood and material to do that. So I'm fortunate enough to know a gentleman that owns his own uh, sawmill and edging machine. So this morning, I made the trek down there and met my friend Zach, and we started milling up a bunch of material for the outdoor shower that we're gonna be putting in at the cabin. So really looking forward to that. Should be a fun project over Memorial Day when we're all at the cabin together. Uh, and here is the start of it. So you're currently watching uh, the sawmill in action and things be run through it. Uh, we had a lot of fun doing it. I learned a lot, that's for sure. It's certainly not as easy as it looks um, to mill up logs into lumber. So now that we got that done, I got it back to my house in the back of my truck. Um, I borrowed some tools uh, as far as a electric planer. We're gonna plane things down a little bit, get them sanded down and ready to go. So it's a little more um, labor involved to use this kind of wood, but I'm really uh, trying to go for that rustic look on the outside of the cabin up there. So let's, uh, let's get going on the planer and see how things go. good news is that works pretty good. The bad news is I'm going to be here for a while. I've hit the wall. I'm gassed. We'll pick this up another day. asking where you've been. Trying to stay far from you. Ah, thanks. Okay guys, so as you can see behind me here, we got the entire base together for the shower. The holes are cut uh, here <laughs> for the four by fours to sit down into it. And I'm working on cutting all the slots. Gosh, this is harder than it looks. Uh, the pieces back there are the slots for the walls that'll stack dry fit together up each four by four wall. So uh, we'll start assembling this so that we can load it in the trailer and take it to the cabin. looks what do you think
All right, guys, so it's getting dark here. We're getting cleaned up. Uh, we did get everything assembled here tonight. We got the door on, we got the sides on. Now we will have to deconstruct it to load it and take it to the cabin uh, for installation just to get it on the trailer. But I want you to take a look at it, tell me what you think. After a long drive and one speeding ticket, we're now at the cabin uh, to enjoy Memorial Day weekend. Got the shower with us. Lily and I just put the base down and got that level. Now we're going to mount it to the side of the cabin and then get the walls installed. So keep watching. I'm sure it is. It's right off the top of the water heater. What do you think, Addison? It's so cool. I feel it. It's cold, all right. How do you know which one's hotter, which one's cold? They're marked CH. Oh, that one's cold. I want the hot back on. Yeah, buddy. This is buddy. Much you need. I think so. Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning into another Blackwell adventure. This one was a cool project and using this rough cut lumber just made it look awesome. Um, if you have any comments, questions or anything like that, please hit me up in the comment section below and please subscribe. We're close to 100 subscribers now. We're going for the 100 mark after this video comes out. So if you have any friends that would be interested in this sort of stuff, please share it and hit that subscribe button for me. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you on the next one.